My name is Dieter Trau. I'm an associate professor here at the National University of Singapore in the Department of uh, Biomedical Engineering. My latest startup that I founded here in Singapore, Tip Biosystems, actually goes back 15 years ago uh, as I was working as a PhD student at Hong Kong UST. One of these ideas um, relates to my work where I frequently had to measure protein concentration and DNA concentration. So this was a very tedious way because I have to move to another a room to find a so-called spectrophotometer and uh, at this time I thought there must be a better way, faster way and I came up with the concept of a personal handheld photometer device which I called Photopatter and which I developed later to a full product here in Singapore at NUS. So from the first idea of a potential uh, technology or product it's actually a very long way to build a product that a customer can use, which is reliable and safe to use, uh, it might take more than 10 years. In my case, of this concept of building a personal photometer, it took me actually 15 years from the original idea until I had the device in my hand which was working. So both of my startups I founded here in uh, Singapore at uh, NUS. Uh, which is IOXA and the biosystem, so they are both based on, on intellectual property and technology that I developed at my lab. First, um, this development was supported by uh, research grants from different government bodies. Until coming to a stage where I could present a working prototype and that enables me actually to attract private funding and uh, venture funding to build a commercial entity and to grow the business. My research will benefit uh, scientists and engineers in the field of life sciences and medical research and uh, drug development by enabling them to generate much more data in a shorter time with lower cost. This basically accelerates uh, research and, and development and uh, at the end, enables them maybe to bring a drug earlier on the market and by doing so, you know, improving the quality of life of uh, people and at the end, the society.